Thank you for joining me again. Jerome Estes, Design Area Engineer from the Division of Project Support at the Colorado Department of Transportation. In this video, I provide a summary of Chapter 8 intersections from the 2023 CDOT Roadway Design Guide. Chapter 8 offers important design guidance on intersections, the transportation features often considered to be the most dangerous areas along a facility. An intersection is defined as a general area where two or more roadways join or cross, including the roadway and roadside facilities for traffic movements within it. Intersections operate with vehicles, pedestrians, and bicycles proceeding in many directions, often at the same time, creating the potential for conflicts. Managing these conflicts are the basis for most intersection design standards, criteria, and proper operating procedures. One of the most important subjects to master within Chapter 8 is intersection site distance. Guidance on intersection site distance often applies to crucial locations outside of that known as a traditional intersection. A prime example of this being non-signalized interchange ramp terminals. In this application, the left turn from stop condition typically controls. Intersection site distance calculations may also be required at signalized interchange ramp terminals if right turn on red is permitted. Chapter 10 of this guide and Chapter 9 of the 2018 AASHTO Geometric Design of Highways and Streets offers more information on these types of cases. An intersection is an important part of a transportation system because to a great extent, the overall efficiency, safety, speed, cost of operation, and capacity of the system depend on intersection design. In other words, intersections are often the controlling links of the larger system. This chapter discusses many design considerations for intersections, including human factors, capacity, design elements, and multimodal integration. Designers and engineers identify the type of intersection needed to appropriately lay out alignment and profile features, site distance, intersection curves with safe and effective turning lane movements, channelization, and island designation. These movements may be managed by roundabouts, traffic signals, signing, and channelization depending on the type of intersection. Attention to a safe, detailed design will result in thoughtful super elevation at intersections, wrong way entry mitigation, stopping site distance, and adequate auxiliary lengths. Median openings as they relate to traffic volume and type of vehicle, as well as flushed or traversable medians, are an important design element when considering a comfortable intersection movement. The implementation of indirect left turns, U-turns, and traffic control devices can be used to achieve safe and efficient operations. Multimodal considerations are again a common thread in Chapter 8 that concludes with special topics like lighting, driveways, and railroad crossings. In the next video, I will provide a summary of Chapter 9 roundabouts.